Hey there folks, so a while back I was uh, doing some traveling and I was in the air uh, playing my uh, DS. My DS's battery is actually running a little low, um, my 3DS that is, and uh, randomly I saw that the little um, PSS system showed me, hey there's a person on this plane who is playing Pokemon. I was like, really? That's kind of awesome, um, because I was on a r rather small plane too and so the odds were not good. Uh, especially considering I've been on a big plane not that long ago and there had been no one on that plane who had been playing Pokemon. And so I was like, okay, cool, let's see if he wants a battle. And indeed, he did want a battle. There was actually someone else on the plane, too, who wanted a battle. Um, and I'll get to them, uh, later this week. So anyway, leads off with a Draglagle, um, as I lead off with my Galvantula. I don't see a spinner, uh, and when I don't see a spinner, I feel like it's a good opportunity to set up Sticky Web. So Dragogol is going to go for Shadow Ball, and I'm going to be honest here, uh, I was so excited about the battle that I kind of forgot what this thing's typing was. Um, so I was like, I feel like there's some water involved, and maybe some dragon, but I think it's poison type too. And I sent out Bo, it's like, no, 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 poison type, poison type. So, yeah, you know, Sludge Bomb, super effective, there's a massive amount of damage. Bo now is taking a massive amount of damage, why did I do that? But it's like, but it is dragon. So let's go for the Hyper Voice, see how much damage it does. Um, and good to know that poison resists, um, fairy. So, uh, Bo actually survives, but only on 40 and gets poisoned. And so now I, I can take it out, but it's going to be costly. I mean, either way, it's not good for me. And it's not good for little Bo. Um, so I figure just go for the, uh, hyper voice and do what he needs to do. And, uh, my opponent's going to go out into Gyarados. And, um, so, yeah, gonna get the Intimidate off, don't particularly care, uh, Special Attacker and whatnot. Uh, if only these things could start off in their Mega forms, because, I mean, looking at his team, if he's got a Mega, that's, that's the only Mega that he could possibly have. Thank God there's no Mega uh, Capacitus, because that would be horrendous. It would be even bulkier than regular Capacitus, and even more annoying. Um, anyway, I go ahead and switch out, go out into Hugabug. And I'm thinking, well, what's he going to do? Uh, he goes for Scald, so a special attacking Gyarados. Never ever seen one of those ever. Decides to withdraw Gyarados, probably pretty smart. He goes out now into Hydreigon. Um, you know, unless he's Scarfed, that's a pretty bad switch, because I'm going to outspeed, and I'm going to go for the Bug Buzz. Uh, so go for the, t uh, the Thunder, doesn't do very much. Um, and now I just go for the Bug Buzz. So, yeah, that's going to be a dead Hydreigon. So if you'll notice, it looks like Pretty much all his Pokemon are shiny, so more power to you if you've got the access to the shinies, but, um, you know, I don't know. Uh, now out is going to be his, um, Delphox, uh, and never found this thing to be particularly good. I'm actually running one on my playthrough of Y, and I barely use it at all. Uh, so I go out and puff my Magic Dragonite, because no matter what, I don't think he's going to be doing anything that's super effective against the dragon. Uh, and indeed, as long as so I, as he didn't get the burn here, which is the only way this could have been a, you know, annoying move or an annoying thing. So um, yeah, I figure, based on his team, I figure that he's only got one Pokemon that's um, uh, that's resists earthquake, and I figure let's just go for the earthquake. So indeed, Toxic Pro comes out and dies on the turn, and that's great. Yeah, so I'm locked in because I'm banded. Um, but I don't particularly care. Now he goes out into Dragobolt, not sure why. I think he, number one, forgot about the Sticky Web, and number two, perhaps, didn't... No, I guess he forgot about the Sticky Web. Uh, maybe forgot he was Poison-type? I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take out Dragobolt. Uh, obviously he doesn't realize that I'm banded, because if he realized I, I was banded, he would go out into Gyarados. Now he's like, oh, maybe he's banded, and goes out into Gyarados. Oh, Gyarados was shiny! So yeah, everyone on his team is shiny. Um, to which I say more power to you, man. Go for your shinies. If you want to use all shinies, go for it. I'm um, going to go out into Cosmic F here, because I'm thinking there's a Mega Evolve coming. Although, actually, that would be pretty stupid to go for a Mega Evolve when I'm locked into Earthquake. I'm just going to say that. And indeed, he did Mega Evolve. So I could have stayed and gone for the Earthquake, and that, that range of health probably KO'd, because Mega Evo Evolution happens first. And you lose the Flying type. So, um, that's, I don't know. But uh, he's going to go for the Thrash, uh, Cosmic F can take that because it's bulky, and I can just take it out with, oh, so he goes for another Thrash because he outspeeds, fine, whatever, Cosmic F can take that, and I'm just going to go for the Close Combat, super effective, Don't didn't even really need it, but whatever, let's just take out that thing, and that is a dead Gyarados, and he's got two Pokemon left, 
and I've lost none so far. Although Bo is not doing particularly well because of my stupid my stupidity earlier. Here I could have uh, I could have switched out Cosmic F and saved it for later. But I decided let's stay in, go for the sucker punch, get some damage off. I'm kind of curious to see how much it does. Does not KO, but gets him pretty low. Goes for the psychic, and so fine. My opponent's going to get a kill. Good for you. You deserve one kill. Just one though. I'm gonna keep you to one kill. That's my plan. Um, based on the Pokemon he has left, I figure go out into Billy D. Williams, my Landorus, and this is going to be a good game, because I can just go for the Earth Power, take him out. I don't know whether Earth Power can one-shot Cathagoras, but Cathagoras is also, um, you know, I, I don't think that he can one-shot me. So yeah, final Pokemon, also shiny, uh, that's fine, and let's just see how much Earth Power does. And so I go for the Earth Power, and Pythagoras' health is going to go down, down, down. Oh, by the way, coordinating, I will say this, coordinating a battle against someone who you can't talk to, and you just kind of have to guess the format that they want, is a pain in the ass. I think I originally was trying to do a doubles battle, and there was all this canceling. I was like, do you want a battle or not? And so finally we settled on, like, level, and you want to do level 50 all, because if they don't have all level 100 Pokemon, then it doesn't work out. Um, so yeah, anyway, that was a long way of... That was a long digression, but I hope you enjoyed that battle at 50,000 feet. So long, folks.